time has come to translate our feelings and our words into deeds, the only thing that the Nazis respect. <laughs> to consider the problem of jointly providing within their own boundaries and colonies new homes for the Jewish people now in Germany. Second, that the President recommend to this conference that since the action of the German government has created this problem, and since that government is taking from the German Jews the money which would otherwise be available to meet the initial costs of resettlement, therefore these costs shall be charged to the German government. until the German government makes satisfactory arrangements to meet these costs, each government participating in the resettlement plans shall forbid all exports, loans, and credits to Germany. <laughs> and all imports from Germany. and that all monies owing to Germany from their citizens through commercial and financial transactions shall be paid to the respective governments to be held until a satisfactory arrangement with the Nazi government shall be concluded. <laughs> people unanimously refuse to buy Nazi goods. that organized labor takes steps to meet its responsibility for participating in the shipment of goods to Germany, especially war supplies. <laughs> the American League must also point out that any proposals to relieve the suffering of the Jews in Germany <laughs> offer no solution of the main problem of the barbarism and aggression of the Nazi government. The Nazis continuously persecute other religious and political minorities. Along with other fascist governments, they have a continuous program of aggression against other nations. They have reasons for the points in this program. We want a conflict. <laughs>